Hello guys, in this video we will discuss how to build our own ERC20 token with the help of Open Zeppelin. Open Zeppelin contracts help you minimize risk by battle tested libraries of smart contracts for Ethereum and other blockchains. It includes the most used implementation of ERC standards. So this is the documentation. You can see various topics listed here like extending contracts, tokens, API, etc. They have also provided example codes here. So let's see the GitHub repository of Open Zeppelin. In contracts, tokens, we can find the ERC20 file. So this is the solidity file containing all the basic and advanced code to build the tokens. This will reduce our tasks and provide more functionalities to our tokens. Now let's open the remix and create our solidity file. Let's name it as a mytoken.sol. Let's start the code by defining solidity version. Pragma solidity 0.8.0. Now import the ERC20 GitHub contract file with import and the path to the file. Now let's define our smart contract mytoken and extend it to the ERC20 which is already defined in the imported file. Then use constructor and get initial token supply from the contract deployer as argument. Also we have to pass the token name and symbol as arguments to the ERC20 constructor which is defined in the imported file. Then use underscore mint function and pass two arguments msg.sender and token supply. You can see this function is defined and declared as internal so we can use it. This will create the new tokens equal to the numbers provided in the second argument and will be deposited in the account address provided as the first argument. If you want to replace the default token decimals, as you can see in this file, it's 18. We can call the function and return our custom token decimal. So let's define it. Function decimal public view virtual override returns uint 8 and return the token decimal. We will use 8. Let's compile the contract. And before deploying, make sure to select the correct contract, provide the initial supply and hit the deploy button. As you can see after successfully deploying, we will get the interface to interact with the public functions here. As the contract is extended, we will get all the public functions here to use. Let's check decimal, name, symbol and total supply. As the complete token amount is minted to the contract owner account, we will check the balance. It should be the same as the total supply. So this is how we can create our own ERC20 tokens with the help of Open Zeppelin in a very easy steps. You can get the complete smartbook on dappworld.com. See you in the next video.